XRP, final days. 400 trillion burn on its way. But XP's failures are also related to the SEC's lawsuit against Ripple. But, as it became known, Ripple can count on the support of the U.S. presidential administration. Welcome to the Rich Club channel. If you like this video, don't forget to like it and subscribe to the channel. Do you think the analysts are right about XRP? Write the answers in the comments. If you like this video, don't forget to like it and subscribe to the channel. Giving away 500 XRP at the end of the week. One random subscriber will receive XRP coins. Take a look at the instructions in the comments section. All you need to do is write the word XRP, watch the video, to the end, to like and subscribe. According to CoinMarketCap, the price of XRP has increased by more than 12% in the last 24 hours, outpacing the other 10 largest cryptocurrencies by market capitalization. The price of XRP drifted sideways for some time, as investors and market participants waited for evidence that the markets were ready to get rid of the negative effects of January. However, on February 4, the price resumed its growth and has since increased by more than 28%. At the time of publication, XRP is trading at $0.767 after reaching a high of $0.775 earlier. Udot today previously reported that XRP has had a negative average MVRV since the end of June, according to data from Santiment. According to the network analytics company, this key indicator was last in positive territory in mid-December, which makes XRP a strong candidate for a price hike to provide traders with some solace. The cryptocurrency market is showing a recovery along with traditional markets. At the time of publication, most altcoins were increasing in value, usually an increase above 3%. The overall valuation of the entire cryptocurrency market also rose to almost $2 trillion as digital assets recovered. In addition to the tailwind from the larger markets, XRP bulls seem to have several other factors working in their favor, which contributes to the price increase. Investors seem to be optimistic about XRP as Judge Annalisa Torres takes over the case. This may be due to expectations that the case could accelerate after the takeover. UDOT today previously reported expectations as Judge Torres takes office, and attorney Jeremy Hogan said the trial could become more interesting for Ripple as major decisions are made. Judge Annalisa Torres granted and partially rejected the defendant's request to close the exhibits in the SEC case against Ripple. In addition, Judge Torres ordered three documents to be opened. This is a notice of Brad Garlinghouse's testimony in an official SEC investigation, Chris Larson's email string, and Brad Garlinghouse's email. John Deaton, attorney for XRP holders in the dispute, believes that Judge Torres' orders are a positive omen for his clients. Since last Friday, when the cryptocurrency began to grow rapidly from $37,500, the situation with BTC has remained significantly more positive. Bitcoin rose to $40,000 and exceeded it in a matter of hours for the first time since mid-January. The asset remained relatively calm, around $41,500 over the weekend, before it initiated another price hike. This time, the bulls brought it to $43,000 for the first time since the market-wide correction began on January 21. At the moment, BTC has not been able to decisively restore this level and has rolled back several hundred dollars. However, its market capitalization has exceeded $800 billion. Just last week, this figure was below $700 billion. Most of the alternative coins have followed BTC, showing impressive growth over the past few days. Ethereum, for example, was struggling to stay above $2,000 just a week ago. However, now the second largest cryptocurrency is worth well above $3,000 and even challenged $3,100 a few hours ago. Binance Coin, Cardano, Solana, Polkadot and Terra have shown similar growth in the range of 2% to 4% over the past 24 hours. 
more impressive growth came from Dogecoin and Avalanche. Nevertheless, Ripple and Shiba Inu took the main place among the altos with a larger capitalization. As previously reported, SHIB has exploded by more than 20% in a day and is about $0.00003. XRP, on the other hand, is up about 13%. As a result, the asset reached a three-week high at more than 75 cents. More profit from Quant, 17%, BitTorrent, 16%, LEO, 14%, Kadena, 13%, Loopring, 12%, Gala, 10%, and Phantom, 10%. The capitalization of the cryptocurrency market has increased by about $60 billion since yesterday and amounts to $1.950 trillion. XRP doesn't look very good right now. I think we're probably going to hit those lows here, 50 cents, and push, towards that weekly level of demand that we have here. Again, this level is important because from this level we saw a serious upward movement after what lasted essentially about six months of consolidation. Thus, the source of the point at which this consolidation begins to break, whether it is the ascending or descending side, usually then acts as support or resistance when revisited. So in terms of a high time frame, you can expect this region as a whole, and the closer we are here, this common region will act as a support, as we have seen in the past. Credible Crypto says there are serious fundamental reasons to hold XRP despite the ongoing price decline. According to the Cryptanalyst, the lawsuit between Ripple Labs and the SEC, which was filed in December 2020 in connection with allegations that XRP was sold as an unregistered security, may eventually provide regulatory clarity for the token, while the rest of the space will end up in limbo. The reason I'm still holding such a huge amount of XRP, despite the sluggish price movement, is that I now view it as a hedge against the rest of the market. If this SEC lawsuit ends, and I think it will end, I do not know when, but I think it will end favorably for Ripple and XRP eventually, and when it does end, XRP will, in fact, be the only crypto asset with regulatory clarity in the United States. The live XRP price today is zero US dollars and 77 cents with a 24-hour trading volume of 2 billion 942 million US dollars. We update our XRP to USD price in real time. XRP is down 5.46% in the last 24 hours. Do you think XRP can win the SEC? Write the answers in the comments. That's it for today. Thank you for watching this video to the end. If you liked it, don't forget to like it and subscribe to the channel.